Okay, this is a short video approaching Crossgates Roundabout from Colton heading towards the airport. So we're just coming into oh. Crossgates now where the dual carriageway begins. It's dropping to a 30 and it's expanded into two lanes. So I'm keen to keep to the left lane as is a normal driving position. The traffic lights are changing so I'm preparing to stop. Traffic lights now changed, pedestrian crossing, the Pelican crossing. And so we're coming into cross gates now. I can see there's two lanes. As we get closer, we're looking for the signs for the airport. Now they are slightly obscured by the trees. So now I'm going to move into the right hand lane. And the reason I'm doing this is, although you can't see it on the camera, the airport is the third exit as we approach. Now it's marked as a head, the ring road, and it can be done in either the left or the right hand lane. Now whilst we'd normally do this in the left lane, we're gonna do it in the right hand lane because I can see on the exit road, there are parked cars in the left lane, which will make it very difficult to get past if I exit in the left lane. So we're now coming into Crossgates Roundabout, if I exit in the left lane. So we're now coming into Crossgates Roundabout, we're going ahead, so we're not indicating. So it's green lights have come through. Come on, that's the first exit we're passing. And we're about to pass the second exit. And I'm gonna check the inside and the left mirror and signal. Now I'm gonna keep an eye on those left mirrors in particular as we leave. And as we come off onto the dual carriageway again, you can see all the parked cars on the left. There's insufficient room in the left lane to use it. So we're gonna use a right hand lane until we've cleared the parked cars. Then once we've cleared the parked cars, we'll be looking to return back to the left-hand lane.